Hello, Xavier here. Welcome back to the channel. And today we're going to be playing a new game called World Box. And as you can see, I now have a new thing into the actual uh, YouTube, which is going to be this uh, avatar of mine. And then I've done an avatar before in the past where it's just a drawing that I made a long time ago. But one of my friends, uh, which I will link down in the description below, she has her own YouTube channel. I'm pretty sure you guys heard of her already. Um, it, she's in the channel, uh, you know, on the right. But hey, uh, she made this avatar for me. Plain and simple, they don't want it to be too much, and it is exactly the same as my other one that I made two, two I want to say two years ago, but a long time ago. Uh, but let's get back right into this game. This is a new game that I purchased called World Box, and uh, you're basically, it's your world, and you can do whatever you want with it. I think this is going to be a pretty fun, just just fun overall. Um, so yeah, let's say, let's see what we can do here. Uh, all your powers at the bottom panel bottom panel here are some important buttons press anywhere to save button use it to save and load your world uh custom world create world and with bigger size cool world laws customize your rules for your world Ooh, uh drawing tools to create your world uh you can change your brush type okay uh, civilizations use it to create villages as well as kingdoms so just cool creatures and monsters looking for dragons so this is the place uh nature and disasters there's also some tools to help your ooh, civilization. I press anywhere to continue. Uh, destruction powers. Wow. Okay. And other various powers and menus. Nice. Um, there's so much more stuff in there. Try them out and experiment. Okay. Enjoy the game. The creators. Oh, wow. Okay. So uh, here we are uh, in this tiny little island looking place that we call our world. So I, I think this is a good place to actually start and see. Let's see, I want to see what the world rules are. Uh, randomly events, peaceful monsters, animals, and other creatures won't attack anyone. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, mm, cities, okay, I think that's all. Okay, that's all I need. Um, what else do I got? So, I can favorite this world. Oh, okay. Um, I can look at the world. Oh, Isle of Man. Okay, that's what it's called. Uh, it's been here for 11 years. Good lord. Uh, just... Oh my, oh my god, that was loud. Um, world age, 11 years and 3 months. Beast, 23. Total deaths, 10. Creatures eaten, 8. And other deaths, 3, 661. Are there any humans in the... No, there are no populations. But I think we can fix that, guys. We have both humans, elves, orcs, and dwarves. We're going to just j jump straight in and uh, see. I'm just going to put some uh, humans here. <laughs> Yeah, all right, looking good so far. Um, I can actually change the speed as well if I'm correct. Um, let's do times uh times five and see this civilization grow. I want to see the civilization grow. So wow, there's a lot of stuff here. Like there's a lot. What is this? Uh, printer island, printer squares. Interesting. Okay. Uh, let's see what else I can do nature stuff wow, so they're building their village which is interesting uh, i do want to see that and i do want to see that as well so right now looking good so far uh let's put some new uh interesting stuff like let's put some elves up here let's do some elves up here and there we go we got some elves right there let's put some dwarves not or i mean dwarves uh orcs over here on this peninsula over here some more over here and that's, oh my god, that's loud for me, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so from, oh, wow. Nice, nice, nice. So I'm just gonna have this here. Some dwarves here. Put some more dwarves. I'm just gonna have a different type of, uh... There we go. Okay, so let's uh, put some more humans in there too. Throw some humans here. Alright, and uh, let's just see how this turns out. I, this is gonna be very interesting to see what happens. Um. I'm very curious to see what happens. What do you guys think is going to happen? Which uh, villagers triumph? Wh which one will... Oh my god. Okay, so here we are. I think they're trying to kill the others. <laughs> they are. These guys are attacking these guys. These are who... What? Humans? No, they're not humans, are they? Yeah, they're humans, huh? No, they're dwarves. Okay, so they're killing the dwarves. The only dwarves down here. Oh, wow. Okay, so... Uh, is that an elf? I think that's an L. The last elf. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah, this is a. 
of skills is minus. Okay, so uh, no, we don't. Okay, so this is dwarves right here then. Okay, so let's look at some uh, interesting stuff like piranhas we can have here. Um, what is this? Gold or ones? Cold ones. Ancient creatures to bring cold. Wait, I was reading that. Uh, bring cold to the land around them. Hate everything living. Okay, got the bandits. Place TNT and demons. Okay, Oof, wow. Got zombies. And we got skeletons, which is interesting. Uh, sand spider creates sand and then dies. Huh. Robot Santa. What? <laughs> oh my god, this is gonna be so fun. Okay, what is this? A UFO. Okay, so now we have a UFO in the world. Let's see. He's gonna take away the. Uh, what is he gonna do? I don't know, but let's see what. Just follow this UFO. Interesting. I'm gonna follow this UFO, see where he goes. I'm gonna take some cows. Well, I don't think there's cows here, but. He's gonna go away. Well, maybe we can have an alien invasion, just like. Aliens everywhere. Oh look, so it looks like this uh, kingdom here actually formed... Wow, are these UFOs doing something? No, they're just flying around. Okay. Let's, uh, let's put some demons here. Right here, can they actually go on the lava? Okay. They can. The demons have come. I wonder if they can defeat the thing. Can they defeat the demon? I wonder, I don't know. Uh, this is a Godfinger multiplayer simulator. Ah. It says that. Uh, so it's basically simulator. Interesting. Okay, uh, let's put a dragon down. Dragon appears here. Dragon shall destroy. Dra uh, no? Okay, dragon does not destroy. He's just gonna go somewhere else. What is this dragon gonna do? Anyways, guys, what do you guys think of the avatar? Um, I, I need a better webcam to actually sink into the actual movement. So right now, I'm just kind of standing there with my mouth moving with my actual voice. So until I can get a webcam, because apparently all of them have been sold out in Best Buy and Walmart. Because, you know, everybody... Why, what? Is, this dragon is doing nothing? Okay, I'm completely fine with that. What is this? Living plants. Make plants and trees come to life. Bro! Oh my god, I can make him move around. <laughs> Let's make all of them move around. That'll be so fun. Everything moves around. Oh my god, can I make houses move around too? Oh my god, yes, I need to. Oh my god, so they these people will not be houseless? Is that what it is? Everything's moving around. What the heck? Oh my god, that is so freaking hilarious. Let's put these uh abs down, maybe. Right, maybe something will happen. Wow, so everything just moves around, huh? Look at that. Okay, well, uh, let's put down some. Oh my god, I gotta kill myself there. Uh, let's put do some skeletons and stuff. Do some skeletons. Skeletons shall rule the world. All right, well, let's actually destroy the world a bit more. So we got the force. Ooh, we got the force. The force does so many stuff for us. We also got lightning. Ooh. We can also make an area much colder, so let's, if I wanted to make this area cold, I can do such such deeds. I can make this whole area tropical. Uh, let's actually make your... Is that rain? Is that what it is? Rain. The rain. Interesting. And then you got acid rain, which kills absolutely everything. You got fire. Sparks fire, so I can make fires go around everywhere. Nice, and then I got, what is this, lava? Oh my god, that is uh, that is something uh, interesting right there. Lava's just gonna go everywhere, <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's try an earthquake. Wow, how about a tornado? Will the UFO go away? Wonder, can I actually strike it with lightning? I can, the UFO is done for. Whoa, did you see that? Oh my god, that's pretty freaking cool. That tornado is gonna go everywhere and just destroy everything. Wow, that's crazy. Let's uh put this thing down. I guess that's uh like for like 
some water and stuff. This is acid right here. Acid geyser. People are gonna die right there. People are gonna die here too. And you got a volcano, which is gonna be really freaking amazing. Put one right here. Does it create land? I wonder. I'm very curious to see if it creates land. No. Oh my god. Everything's just hectic right now. Where is that dragon though? Dragon hasn't done anything, has it? Unless it already died. I just see everything going inflamed over here. What the heck is going on over here? It's complete chaos. Oh look, it's a dragon. Dragon's over here. I found the dragon. Do I need to spawn more dragons to actually see some form of destruction? First of all, put some of these cold guys in. Yeah. Some evil beings. And then we're gonna put some pirates or uh, people over here. More demons over here as well. Oh my god, these things are blowing stuff up. I this world is already hectic already, guys. Put some zombies in this actual village over here. And uh let's put another robot Santa going in. This world is so dead dead. Oh my god, this is so much fun. We can put like rain clouds and stuff, which is really cool, as well as acid clouds. Oh my god. And what is is this lava clouds? Oh my god, that is freaking amazing. Wow, look at that guys. Everything's just hectic. Ooh, now we're getting into the real stuff right here. So we got TNT, which I can put right there. Wow, okay, I should probably uh, lower that amount. And now it's more. Yeah, so TNT is pretty cool. Water bombs. Okay, then we got delayed TNT, which I'm guessing does what it says it's gonna do. Landmines. So I'm gonna just. Wow, okay. So you got grenades. Woo! We're gonna zoom in a lot more and let's just like destroy stuff. What? Ooh, a napalm bomb. You guys ready for this? Oh, I'm so. I'm just gonna boop. Woo! Oh my god, that doesn't do a lot, but let's let's do the antimatter bomb. Whoa! Let's do the bomb. I wanna see what the bomb, the, the regular other bomb does. I can just be like. Wow, okay, so that's uh, an atomic bomb. <laughs> what does this do? The Cesar Bomba. Oh my lord. Okay, well, let's see. Uh, bowling balls. What the heck? That's so funny. What? Well, I, I just literally go like that. I just like, boop. Yep, it should explode after that. Okay, cool. Heat ray. Oh my god. There's a heat ray of everything. It's just like... Wow, okay. So let's do meteorites. Oh my god, I need to see this like... I can't believe there's people even alive after this. Alright, let's 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 just completely do something crazy, guys. Let's uh, put some fireworks down, right? I'm gonna put them around, right? Yeah, because there's fires everywhere. And I'm just gonna completely annihilate. And I knew I can't even speak. Annihilate everything. Let's do fire everywhere. There are people still alive in this war. Can you believe it? Alright. For those small survivors, let me give them some actual rain. Wow, that's crazy, guys. That's. That's, uh. I'm just gonna completely destroy this world, guys. Put a bunch of volcanoes around the area. And we're gonna destroy this world. Put some regular stuff around here. Just randomly place clouds around me. Let's put some fire ones too, like, why not? Right? Yeah, just do earthquakes everywhere and then just lightning bolts. This world is going to hell. <laughs> oh my god, this is crazy, guys. This is crazy fun, though. What is this? Fairy, peaceful creatures heal everyone around it. For those that live. For those that may live. There's only two survivors in this world now, guys. Can you believe it? And they're orcs! The orcs have prevailed! The orcs have prevailed. Well, this world is no more. 
I shall be with a bunch of dragons. Damn, wow, this world is completely gone, guys. Oh my lord. This dragon is sleeping, wow. Oh my god, look, they're all sleeping, that's funny. We still got fireworks in the area, too, like, it's funny. They're also, this guy's literally sleeping on top of water. Okay, well, I'm completely gonna kill everything, guys, so let's, uh... Let's just napalm everything. Here comes the lag, guys. Oh my god, this is so crazy. The whole world is dead now. There's no chance anything survives this. Look at the dragons. Good heavens. You're telling me land actually survived? Wow. Okay, well, let's uh, just completely... Can I do that? Let's destroy the world. There's nothing left to be here. That's crazy. Well, I guess I'll do the antimatter one. Just like delete everything. Wow, guys, that is insane. What does this do? Infinity coin removes half of it. Oh, wow. Okay, I get it. <laughs> wow, guys, this is crazy. This is actually gonna be a pretty fun game. And the cool thing is, I can let's say uh, soil for this. Add water to grow grass. Uh, okay, cool. So let's uh, let's just start building something real quick uh, that we can actually build from the scratch. So, um. I think right here I'm, I'll build a, a mountain right here in the middle. You know, actually, let's create a new world, right? Make the world big. World size can affect game performance. Yes, gigantic. Small islands. Hmm. Uh, actually, can I make that small? Actually, yeah. Random shapes. Yep. And then water level. Uh, standard. Let's do. Let's do. Let's do large, right? Let's let's create this world, right? It's gonna create the new world, and we'll see how that looks. How's that looking so far? Um, well, yeah, I'm not very satisfied with that one. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let's uh, small islands. No, let's do. Thirty. Yeah, let's do thirty. And then random shapes. Fifty. Water level pretty low there we go now that is a better world right there look at that and you know what's even better I'm actually gonna make this land over here completely cold right here so let's start out with that so I'm gonna decrease the temperature in this world right here let's uh decrease the temperature here there we go gonna make sure this area is nice and cleanly there we go so there we go we got the ice continent up there which is really cool now let's place uh see what else we can do so we're gonna we already created the world which is freaking amazing already looking good uh now let's place uh, actual humans but first i actually want to separate each uh each uh, individual place so Let's make this right here the uh, elves or something, and let's just do that, right? I'm gonna put a big gap between these two over here, right there, and then we're just gonna see after that what, what what's gonna happen to the world. We're just gonna make sure that this is nicely done here. And there we go. Just there you go. It doesn't need to be perfect, so there you go. Are, they, are there already humans there? No, there's not humans. Are there bees? Okay. So there we go. There we go. Shallow waters, just for the hell of it. Right there. It's going to be pretty cool. Alright, so that's where the elves are going to live, right? Let me make sure to take away the uh, fast speed. Let me pause it, right? Before we actually go back to marry, making everything work. We're going to have the elf kingdom over here. Okay, so we're going to... Put a bunch of elves in this area. There we go. Now, we're gonna create another rift over here. And we're gonna make this a, a, a bigger rift, actually. Uh, let's make it nice and big. Not too big. Um, make it like that. Do that. Right. 
Oh, whoa, whoa. All right. Pause. So I want to unpause it. Let it go in and then bam. Okay. So there we go. Just separated that. Let's go back to this and let's go to. Let's actually put the orcs over here. We're going to put the dwarves over here. We're going to put the humans in here. The humans must be abundant. There's a settlement right there. I'm hoping that the orcs stay here and then they probably go over here actually. Um, I'll put some over here to be honest. To be the land of the orcs right here. Um, I can actually erase people right here. Oh, there's a sneakle stuff. I can do madness creatures will be curse, uh, the plague, zombie infection, uh, tumor, grow an island, grows on land and devours what? Everything on its way burns everything. Okay, so gray goo nano bulls. <laughs> okay, and then we're gonna have flame tower. Ice tower spawns cold one squeezes the ground where it's places. Interesting. So I think right here I'll have this. There you go. Little floor right there, and then I think in the middle of everything I'm gonna create a giant land right here. And a giant mountain where it's just completely hell. And we're gonna put some actual volcanoes in there. Put one here, 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 and here. I'm gonna put some lava right here. Make sure it's nice and small though. I don't want it to be too big. Uh, actually. Go, just gonna fill all that up. Make another one right here. And we're just gonna place the actual towers over there. And we're gonna see how it all just turns out. I'm gonna put some fire towers right here. Right there. So if anybody tries to go over here, you know, oh why not why not tell people try to have people come over here just because I don't know, there's some really cool resources like um let's uh let's give them some hmm, Gold, right? Gold is uh, is pretty uh, wanted by everybody. So let's put some bunch of gold in this area, right? And if they can survive, they can get it, right? So, so let's do that. We'll put some iron here so they can try to see if they're interested in doing that. And a bunch of rocks here, just quickly. There we go. So if they want to, they can come to this island right here. Uh, I'm gonna put some uh, actual. Make this a lot smaller. Let's uh, put some the uh, rocks here. Right, a little bit of gold and a lot more iron. Let's do some iron here, and we're gonna put some rocks. Well, I'll put I said stone, it's called stone, so there you go. Put some stone there, some stone there for everybody. Some a little bit of gold for each kingdom, right? And then we're gonna put a lot more over there, some in this peninsula over here, and then a lot more over here as well. There we go. So now we're gonna unpause the thing, right? We're gonna unpause it. See what happens to the actual world. Let's see what let's see what happens, right? Yes, I know, I know, I know. Yes, I'm I'm aware. Sorry, I, I didn't mean to press you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bear. Just 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 leave, leave. There we go. I, I know, I, I know, bear. Okay. Let's go here. I actually wanna press uh settings. There's a burger here, and I, if I press that, I believe there's a debug menu. There you go. And I'm just gonna put Sonic Speed in it. Let's just see what happens. Like how the world changes so quickly. So so far, this is how everything's looking, right? There's three different cap. No, there's like five different capitals by the looks of it. Um, let's, let's see which is which. So, right here we have the humans. We have some humans here as well. Uh, what happened to the orcs is the question. I'm not sure what happened to them, but uh, we'll see what actually happened to them. Uh, I wanted to place down towers. Where is it? I'm pretty sure I placed down some towers, right? Place the tower right here. There, right? 
this is the elves, if I remember correctly. Yes, the elves have a pretty big kingdom already, as I suspected. Uh, you have the dwarves over here. Are these are dwarves. Yes, the dwarves over here pretty have a decent sized kingdom as well. These are all humans, I'm guessing. No? What are the heck are the people? Ah, oh, they're there. These are also dwarves. Okay. So, back. Let me resume this again. And let's play. And I'm just going to see the, the, the year it is. It's already 47 years of the world. So, I think this is going to be a very interesting playthrough. Well, I wouldn't say playthrough. I'd say a very interesting uh, game to play. So, so far, looks good. Everything is just like becoming snow on this area over here. Ooh, there's some invasions going on over here. Some invasions going on over here. Okay, so the elves recovered by the looks of it, but it looks like these might have, uh, the dwarves look like they were invading. Okay, so I think it's a good time uh, to, I think every hundred years I'm going to spawn in a bunch of skeletons in each kingdom so they can fight it off. So let's just speed up the process again, and we'll do that. They're just going to spawn out of nowhere. So this is looking decent so far. Each kingdom already having a pretty good standing for themselves. Um, it looks like the fire tower is making demons. So yeah, the demons are just like trying to get to the land. <laughs> Um, the elves doing pretty good, uh, but it looks like, wow, so the bigger kingdom is obviously the human kingdom is doing freaking amazing right now. Nothing can touch them right now. They actually conquered the entire thing that I wanted them to do. There's two different kingdoms, but as you can see, they actually have, oh, they're actually invading the dwarfs right now, the, the island for them. So the dwarves might get snuffed out. It's almost 100 years. After it gets 200 years, I'm going to pause it. And then we're going to just put a bunch of uh, skeletons in that one specific area. Almost there. Almost there. It's been okay. So I'm going to pause it. And I'm just going to put it in each capital. So there's four different capitals. I'm going to zoom in. And I'm going to be like, okay, well, a bunch of um, skeletons are going to spawn right here. So that's what I'm going to do. Skeletons. Put a bunch of them and see if they can survive. Okay. Okay, and then another one right here. Another one right here. In each kingdom. Now we're gonna unpause and see what happens. What do you guys think is gonna happen? Are they gonna die down? What's gonna happen? Wow, they are dying quickly. Oh my god, the human kingdom is dying. Well, at least the one capital, that one capital is. Uh, they don't have a lot of strength as well as the dwarf. Kingdom is really dying down. They didn't have a lot of space to begin with, but I think they've defeated all the skeletons. It, it's been three years ever since I placed them down, and it looks like they're slowly starting to rebuild. But you know, oh my god, are there still skeletons? These guys have been fighting skeletons for almost four years, and they still haven't gotten them. That's crazy. Then you got over here, um, looks like the dwarves have actually completed pulling most of these things off what it looks like and it looks like these two are the dwarf and the elves are trying to invade each other which is okay I, I, interesting i guess uh skeletons are still alive over here and they're just like li literally just living in that peninsula over there which is interesting wow okay so this is a very interesting game i like this game it's just like just watching the zoom of this so let's actually give them rain um natural rain and they're just gonna prosper they could prosper they could not so we'll see how it goes for them it's just continuous rain for like a while i guess let's do continuous rain for a year and see how that goes for them a year has passed by the years have passed by and it looks like everything has been recovered by the human kingdom. Or at least it's being tried to. Uh, they gotta fix that if they wanna make that little hole right there fixable. It looks like the human kingdom 
have been taken back by the dwarves right here. The dwarves are like, no. Oh my god, the dwarves are going to die. There are no more dwarves. Dwarves are no more. There are only humans and elves. And it looks like the elves started off strong with uh, starting off with this right here. It looks like they're almost about to, like, the annex, they're definitely going to be the next ones fighting for sure. And it looks like they're already trying to fight too, but I'm not sure. Let's, uh, let's give them some food, uh, some food to fight over. So right here, this uh, area has a lot of food for them. And then let's put some bunnies in there too. They're going to want to come in here and actually fight for all this food. This abundance of food they want, I'm guessing, are going to fight for it. Um, let's put abundance of uh, actual trees as well. So let's do, uh, let's do seeds right here that can grow. Do a nice big one. So seeds grow here. And then bushes as well. This kingdom has survived a good amount, so I'm gonna give them some bushes as well as over here. And I'm gonna give them some more trees as well and some more trees for them as well. Uh now rain for everybody. I'm gonna do a big rain so things can just grow a but a bit more. There we go. It looks like the human kingdom is so big right here. Look at that. They've conquered back the skeleton land that they lost. So they're already regrouping it. There's only two kingdoms left. Let's actually pause the game real quick. And I want to see what the world looks like. So there's populations of 923. 131 years have passed. 2,827 people have died. Natural deaths 21. Deaths by 144. Creature eating 7. That's not a lot. And yeah. Uh, but hey, look, look. I'm going to... I think I'm going to pick the smallest kingdom out of all... Both of them, and I'm gonna do something to them. I'm actually gonna give them a plague. Yep. So I'm gonna do one of each. This is the smallest kingdom right here. Just so we can see. Uh, and my friend, you two are gonna have the plague by the looks of it. Okay. And now I'm gonna go to the smallest human civilization and pick two people as well. There we go, and uh, there we go. We're just gonna start and see what everything happens. What what's gonna happen to their civilization? And I've I've given them the plague. Let's see if they actually die or not. I don't know if we have to hit them with it, uh, more than once or not. But let's uh throw our land and devour. Okay, I'm gonna use a tumor right there. This tumor is like evil, as you can see. Yeah, it's evil uh, right there. Um. Nothing happened. Okay, cool. Uh, let's uh, add, what is this right here? Golden brain. Attracts the creatures that like to eat brains. Nothing can. Okay, so. Oh, they do not like that. <laughs> they don't like that. They've turned into zombies. They don't like that. This is the land of the zombies now. We're going to make this the land of the zombies. So we're going to actually put a bunch of zombies here. Let's... We're just going to put a bunch of zombies here. We're gonna... There we go. They've destroyed that land. Yeah, they like this right here. I'm going to put a bunch of them here and... By the time they destroy them all, the world will be... Wow, the human, oh my god, the humans have prevailed. Not only did the plague get them, but the humans annihilated them. Humans are the reigning ones. We'll actually see if they actually survive or not. Because the, the zombies are actually going to go after brains after this. It's almost time for the brains to appear. I'm actually going to slowly put them closer and closer to the actual humans and see what's going to happen. Wow, that's going to be crazy. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. Bam. Good luck with that. And, uh, yeah. It is time for some more destruction. We're gonna... We're gonna put... What is this? Okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna see what this does. Oh my god. This land is being devoured. Oh my god.
goodbye land. The land will now be disappearing. There we go. Oh my god, I saved the land. So there's nothing left over there for them. And that's actually that's a more natural disaster here. We're gonna do Oh wait. Are the zombies invading? The zombies are invading. Will the humans survive or will they die out and wither? I wonder. Are they gonna live or are they gonna die? more humans have started some more civilizations they have tried to I wonder can the humans actually survive this fight can they survive I don't think they can survive the world is almost dead because of the zombies the zombie plague is much bigger and stronger I think we still got some zombies coming in from this land over here yeah they're still coming in and if they get infected the humans will n not grow again oh they're actually growing pretty fast oh my god well then I think we're going to end up with some natural disasters. We're going to put some tornadoes over here. This land was never meant to have good things anyways. Oh my god, that's a lot right there. Look at that. I'm just going to spawn a bunch of them here. The world... Oh wow, it's lagging. Of course it's going to lag. Oh my god. The world is no more. This is the end of the world. I'm actually going to put some freaking like nukes here and like annihilate everything. There's a lot of lag, oh my god. Here we go. It's the moment of truth. Oh my god. That actually did not delete the, the freaking... <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so humans, you are definitely... What can this do? Oh my god, this actually distorts the actual thing, okay. Uh, sponge clears burned tiles, pictures, remove water and lava, sickle. Okay. Abolish all life with a single touch. Wow. This is crazy, guys. This is going to be a pretty fun series. Uh, I'm thinking we can, like, do a world where... All the factions are separated by the sea and see what goes on. So this is a great, great game. I can't, I, I wonder if the humans are even going to survive this time. The civilization, humans have prospered for over how much, how many years? For over 171 years. The world is not so nice to everybody. Humans are the only living things in this world now. And shall they live? I don't know. We shall see. The zombie invasion. Killing them all. There are no longer living things in this world. The zombies have overcome. The zombie infection has spread. And so it is time. It is time to completely destroy this world again. And I do. I need to just like burn everything now. I'm just going to. I would love to just like do all that. It's just created remove creatures removed. So half of life forms have all been destroyed. <laughs> Think we'll end this up with some uh, bombs, right? Boom. This time we're gonna do go big like this. Yep. There we go. And finally, but not least, I'm just gonna goodbye, cruel world. You are a good set of world. Wow. Now we, we're just gonna destroy everything. And there we go. The world is no longer anything. So much lag is happening at once, but we are still here. To watch the world get destroyed. Goodbye world. Are there any survivors? No. But there is still land over there. Well. We're, we're going to leave that land right there. Maybe it will be a nice starting place. For the next world guys. What do you guys think of the new win? Bye bye.
<laughs> what do you guys think of the game? I um, I think it's pretty fun. Um, there's some interesting stuff we can do with this. So just let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of this game, as well as my eye avatar, which I will be getting a camera for. Hopefully soon. If not, you guys will just see me look at you guys straight into the face and just talk while I am watching you guys there. The world is now 109 years old. What will happen to the next one? We shall not know. But I'll see you guys next time. See ya!